finally, the jury is hearing Holmes' innermost thoughts leading up to that mass killing. And it's what's on page 48 titled, Case the Place, that is especially chilling. Let me run through this for you. Targets, random. Method, bombs, with the word X'd out. And in parentheses, too regulated and suspicious. Biological warfare, also crossed out. Too impatient, requires extensive knowledge, chemicals, and equipment. Serial murder, again, X'd out. Too personal, too much evidence. Easily caught, few kills. Mass murder spree, checkmarked. Maximum casualties, easily performed with firearms, although primitive in nature. No fear of consequences. Being caught 99% certain. He considered different venues as well for the murders, the killings, however you want to call them at this point. Airport or movie theater? Airport is crossed out. Substantial security, too much of a terrorist history. Terrorism isn't the message. The message there, the message is there is no message. When you both heard that list that he wrote himself leading up to this whole horror show, was there something in particular that stood out to you when it comes to knowing right from wrong? Because that's all this is about right now. I think probably what attorneys are looking at is the word caught at some point. Uh, just on that list that we saw up there, however, the planning, the detail demonstrates somebody that knows what he's doing, but does that translate to a lack of knowing right from wrong? And remember, the prosecution in Colorado must prove, Colorado is in the minority of states that requires the prosecution to disprove his insanity. And so does it rise to that level when you read those words and talk about that level of planning? Because ultimately all insanity defenses, with all the science, they are ultimately lay people, jurors, who make yeah. that determination. Not, they're, they're, they're hairdressers and mechanics and maybe a journalist or maybe an accountant. Or, so here's the thing. Um, for the prosecution, and yes, this is a little flipped from what we're used to seeing, Randy, in the cases we cover. It's the defense attorney that has to prove that he is insane, knows no right from wrong. But in this list, I saw something that was too regulated and suspicious, too much evidence, easily caught, no fear of consequences, substantial security. Aren't those all translatable into it's wrong, therefore someone's gonna come and get me, so I better not do that method. It certainly creates an issue in terms of the standards, which is, do you know what you're doing is wrong? Can you appreciate the nature and the consequences of your action? But I take a step back. First of all, what is that doing in evidence? That was a diary that was sent to his psychiatrist there is a privilege. So I start there. I then continue on with, if we were just having a conversation and I was talking like that, I would suggest to you your visceral reaction would be, Zelen's out of his mind. And then third, I think there is this, I don't know, there, there's something about recently in our circuit, in the second circuit, fantasy, fantasizing about committing a crime is not a crime.